Hello everyone. An ice cream eating contest is currently being held inside Ginger's ice cream parlor. Come inside. How did you get so big? You know, I don't think Dan Hammond wants me to reveal that. Okay. I should probably ask him myself then. You know, Kate, you're a terrifying sight, but one of beauty. I may be over 20 feet tall, but I'm not single. <laughs> So, Ginger, when will the ice cream eating contest start? It shouldn't be too much longer. If your performance yesterday is anything to go by, you have a good chance of winning. Ginger, don't remind me of the fact that I killed him. Sorry, I feel pretty bad about him too. I mean, he was such a nice kid. Yeah, he was. Um, excuse me, but where is the ice cream eating contest being held? Just open this door and enter Ginger's ice cream parlor. He's only a temporary worker, but the owner has left him alone. Hello everybody! Thank you for coming to tonight's ice cream eating contest. I don't know whether or not the actual owner of this place would ever approve of this, but he's not here, so it doesn't matter. Anyways, I will get the ice cream right now. Hello there. My name is Father. I call myself that because these are my children. What's yours? My name is Dan Hamming. Don't wear it out. Yay. I just met a famous person. Bart, Bill, and Daisy. Don't you know better than to watch such inappropriate news stories? We're sorry. Here you is. You made your own children cry. Shame on you. Okay. So the computer will keep track of how many bowls you eat. But don't start until I say so. That includes you, Dan Hamming. G R R R R R R R R R R R Nobody listens to me anymore. G R R R R R R R R R R R Shop at Lori's. Be good to yourself, shop at Lori's. If you want to live long, be healthy and strong, shop at Lori's Natural Foods. Oh, if you want to live long, be healthy and strong, shop at Lori's Natural Foods. Oh, uch. I solta vea ten mai se crean so fas. No uia vea masi vea dache. Well, I've cleaned up the mess and started the contest back up. I'm so sorry for all of that. I didn't see it coming. Honest. Well, since I seem to be the only one left, it looks like I have won. Sorry, Dan Hatting, but you haven't won yet. Who, other than me, could possibly eat eight full bowls of ice cream in one sitting? <laughs> With this guy That's right After years of obscurity I have returned But why? Nobody's ever heard of you The same cannot be said for your actions Burning hospitals Terrorism Child abuse You sir are deplorable how do you even sleep at night, knowing that you cause the deaths of your own friends? I know you're not an alcoholic, but drinking at your age is simply unacceptable. You don't appreciate people who try to help you. Instead, you cause them pain and suffering. And what about, Kate? Don't you think she needs medical attention? Are you too focused on the gutter? People like you make me sick. I know we all do stupid things sometimes, but you're miles beyond that. I mean, I know you're not stupid, but you gave a lot of people food poisoning, caused a massive fire that destroyed an entire city, and ran naked. You are right. I am pretty impulsive. However, you don't ever talk to me like that. I'm a human being, not a dog to be yelled at. Well then, we'll see who wins this contest, won't we? Guys, 
Less talking, more eating. My arms are getting tired. Before we begin, there's something I have to do. Much better. Oh please, don't be so surprised. I'm like an old god here. Excuse me, you are the face people. What's your name? My name is Dan Hamming. Don't worry about. Oh, I see you've met Greg. I hope the two of you can become good friends. He's a nice kid. Good at school, too. Excuse me. You do not throw your ball at me. It's not funny. You got it? Okay. I will do any more. I promise. Hmm. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 48, 49, 50. He's been working really hard to prepare for the fitness prom because he wants to impress his PE teacher. Hmm, that's odd. I don't recall the fitness program being held for boys as young as Greg. Well, you obviously haven't been to Greg's school. New Camp Elementary. Dan Hammond, how dare you put a hamburger on the ground to make the tractor crash? You could have killed Glenn. Kill? So make sure you send an ambulance to deal with the two men. One of them are seriously hurt, while the other... Not so much...